All right, dudes and dudettes, welcome back to Seopolis, guys. Today we're getting into like the the meat and potatoes of Tinker's Construct. I'm super excited. I haven't used Tinker's Construct in a pretty long while. I mean, we do have two Tinker's tools, but we didn't really get into it. We're going to be making uh, some progress through the quests today, going up through here. So it's going to be fantastic. So, first off, we're going to be making this flint pickaxe head. Uh, okay, that's kind of weird. Um, I'm pretty sure all we need to do is select the pickaxe. We'll go ahead and get some of the flint. Put it in. Maybe we need the flint cubes. Why is that on fire? Stop me on fire. Okay, maybe no... So here, oh, that was easy, okay. All right, flint pickaxe head, there we go. Go ahead and upgrade here. So we are gaining, let's see. What do we gain? We lose durability. Send it, you know what I say, for the quests. That's what you gotta do, it. do it for the quests. We got that guy. All right, so we're gonna be making grout here. Grout is super easy to make, just requires some sand, gravel, and some clay. Uh, now we have a auto, like basically an automatic clay maker here. All we gotta do is put dust in here. The hopper will take it, put it into this wooden barrel that fills up with uh, water from the flopper, and then this hopper, right, comes the, the dust, and then we get clay. Bam, look at that. We have quite a bit of it. It is a very useful thingamadoohickey. So let's go ahead here. We're going to craft up a heck ton of those, and then we are going to have to um, do that. And that, I mean, put it in the blast furnace because it can only be smelted in here. Uh, it can't be smelted in anything else like a normal furnace. I don't think, anyway. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing happens. Okay. No worries. So we're going to let both of these stacks smelt up, and then we're going to be having some fun. All right, so we got both of our two stacks of seared stone, or seared bricks. So what we're going to go ahead and do is claim the quests for both of these, for getting the grout and for that. It wants to go ahead and make a seared heater, which is just, uh, I guess, circles of uh, seared those guys. Perfect. All right, there we go. That is done. Okay, that's very tiny. Seared heater. Okay, uh, place on top of the heater. Cool. So we need to make a spot for this, and I think the good spot is going to be here. All right, so like this. Yes, seared heater. Perfect. Okay, we need to make a seared melter, which requires some glass. Do we have any glass crafted still? We got two. Cool thing is, is if you remember, we... Ah, uh, that's lava. We automated that, the making of sand, so we can just go ahead and smelt it, because we're cool. Oh, we got to put it in the blast furnace. That's right. My phone's going off. All right, in the blast furnace, making short work of those, uh, those guys. We're going to make a seared gauge. Yep, and then the seared melter. Perfect. This goes on top, just like so. All right, that is all of those guys done. Perfect. So we need a faucet, which is very easy to make. We need a tank. can be used instead of heater. Oh, okay. So the heater, we put fuel in here. Perfect. That heats it up, whatever's in here. Amazing. Okay, so that, that makes sense. Um, let's go ahead and make the faucet, or faucets, plural. We're going to put that over to the left here. All right, we've got that made. Now we need the casting table and then the casting basin, which is going to be basically the exact opposite as long as it hasn't changed. Yes. All right, so we got both of them. As we're going to put the casting table here, we're going to put another faucet here in the casting basin. This does full blocks. This does uh, individual items. Okay, so that is done. Ooh, botany pots. I want to make these so freaking bad. Okay, 
So we need molten clay put into here, which is why we don't have it just yet, but this means we no longer have to uh, grind to really like make anything. All right, oh, it only holds three at a time? Mother trucker, dude, okay. Well, it's heating up pretty quick. Um, so we're gonna do this. Why is my phone still going off? Oh, my iPad, my bad. Okay, so this is gonna pour in and we're gonna get uh, terracotta, which is pretty much the only thing holding us back from making the botany pots is we just need some more of these. Okay, and yeah, you can get out of there, perfect. And so with five of those crafted up, all we need to do is smelt up three of these guys to make some bricks. All right, so there we go. We have the bricks to make the pot. Then we can come in here and make the botany pot. Now, if we go ahead and combine this with a hopper, um, a wooden hopper, we can go like so. This becomes a hopper botany pot. Oh my goodness, guys, we no longer have to grow trees. That is what this means. So let's grab you. And then we're also going to grab this guy. We're going to collect this guy back. All right. So we take one dirt here, click that, and then we put the tree here. The tree will grow and we'll put all of the items that we want into here. Leaves, uh, saplings, oak logs, and apples. Uh, I believe sticks too. Uh, yeah, all, all into there. So super happy. I would like to get quite a few of these guys going, but we're just going to do that one for now. All right, botany pot, a botany pot, and boom, cool. So seared tank. Let's go ahead and make one of these guys real quick just to complete the page. And bam, there we go. Tinker's tap chap, ch chapter two has been completed. Oh man, okay, so what's it gonna have us do now? Ceramics, Ah, let's go ahead and make one of these real quick, I guess. Um. Okay, two clay shears. Okay, we gotta put it in a normal furnace. Freaking won't work in a blast furnace, that's annoying. Now, all right, and with two ceramic shears parts, we can go ahead and combine these together and make these ceramic shears, completing this page, I do believe. Red sand. Red snad. Oh, we don't have that yet. So snad, if you give it a redstone signal, will grow things on top of it. Boom, and there's that page. Done. Okay, so we've got those done. Why? Oh. Okay, so we did update, update to the latest uh, version of the pack. So there is uh, some things that we have not done in some of the previous. I guess not even previous, but different ones. Anyway, Anyway, let's do it. All right, driftwood logs and driftwood planks. Okay, we've recompleted the first one. Wood and tech. Oh my! Backpack. Uh, sponge on a stick. Destroy water on the go with a stick. Okay. I guess that's kind of cool. Yeah, we do have a few sponges here, so that's pretty neat. All right, sponge on a stick is a go. We got that guy. Cool beans. Let's go ahead and get those out of my inventory so we can make quite a few more. I need to make seven more. Okay, and then uses, compressed. Okay, so we got these two guys completed. Very cool. Let's come down here. And I should have quite a bit of leather. Three leather. Hey, glow squid. That's cool. Okay, so leather has been completed. Backpack. What do you need? Ah, you need four. Son of a nutcracker. So any other way to make leather?
Ah, oh, rotten flesh. Ah, ah. On a cutting board, that's interesting. Okay, so time to move on to the next uh, blocks of uh, quests here, which is farming and foods. So we're going to go ahead and get into that right away. Uh, so we're going to need some seagrass, which we get from the uh, survivalist strainer here. I do believe we have some, so we can come down here and collect it. Yes, perfect. All right, so we have the seagrass. Very cool. Grass. Gra seagrass can be dropped into water to make some normal grass. Perfect. Okay, let's go ahead and drop it in. There we go. We got normal grass. Super easy. Grass block. Grass block. Grass and dirt makes grass blocks. Grass blocks can be used, can be sieved to get some seeds. Ooh, okay. Do I even have any dirt? How do you make dirt? Oh, that's right. Wooden barrels. All right, so we got four. Oh, that's barrels. We got four dirt now. We can go ahead and make some grass. Perfect. Let's go ahead and sift it up. That's a weird texture. There we go. We got some wheat seeds. Super cool. Ooh, we even got some melon seeds too. All right. Perfect. Okay, let's have a look here. Melon seeds. All right, so we need to make some wheat. Um, I believe we have one dirt left. Perfect. Yay. Okay, you're worthless. Bam, now you're worth something. Let's go ahead and make some... Uh... Ah, my fall down. All right, so we went ahead and made up a stone hoe to go ahead and till the farmland and plant the seeds. So cool. Is there anything we can do to get bone meal yet? Let's have a look. Um, not really. We can put it on the cooking board, the cutting board. Okay, let's go ahead and make a cutting board here real quick. Okay, so here we go. Just a uh, crafting table with two extra sticks. Cutting board. Cool beans. We can place that down. Um, a flint knife. Okay, that's super simple to make. Here we go. Flint knife. All right. We're going to get some fish here. We're going to cook it up. Yeah, I don't think you can put that in there. We need a smokehouse. Can we get a smokehouse? A smoker? Oh, it's just a furnace with uh, some wood around it. Might not be a bad idea. All right, furnace. Two, three, four. Now we have a smoker. Very cool. So we can put food in there now. And it'll cook that even faster. Okay, so I've never used this before, so let's put this guy here. <gasps> oh, I chopped it. So you just right-click, like, oh, yeah. And we did get bone meal. That's exactly what we wanted. All right. Yes! <laughs> so cool. Now we have uh, wheat. And we can just make another botany pot. I fall down. We just make another botany pot, and we can use the wheat in there. Um, so yeah, that'll be super cool. Pipe, whoa, we might put something, got a Nautilus cell, that's cool. I didn't mean to get that, but cool beans. All right, and then we need three of those to obviously make some bread. Melon juice, leafy stew, it seems pretty simple. Gosh dang it, I already had that. Okay, there we go. We unlocked a few quests. Very cool. Raw cod slice. Okay, we can make that. So here we go. Put you there. Chop. Oh, that's cooked cod. 
nothing raw about that. <laughs> Except I messed up. Um, okay, we got we got some raw cod. We're good. Some raw Call of Duty. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'll see myself out. Here we go. There we go. Raw cod. Do we make it to sushi? Okay. Um, pumpkin slice. Got to get a pumpkin. Got to get the pumpkin seeds. We don't got the pumpkin seeds. Okay. So food, I mean, it's cool, but it's really not going to get us further. Can we do anything? Ooh, copper. Copper. Let's see. How do you get copper? Red sand for copper. Okay. So we have a bunch of red sand, so we can start to make the materials, which is very, very cool. Red sand, here we go. Sandy. Uh, that's right, I am Sandy. All right, see if we get some copper. Oh, we got some copper, guys. We're getting materials. So cool. Oh, man, we got nickel, too. Awesome. More copper. All right. I wonder how long until we get the auto sif. All right, so let's see here. We got those, which is fantastic. Um, tin. Where do you get tin from? Oh, just normal sand. Okay, so I'm going to do a stack of normal sand and a stack of the red sand, and then we'll come back and have a party. All right, so with both of those stacks sifted, guys, this is what we have. We have quite a bit of materials. We have a bunch of niter. We have three cinnabar, eighteen tin, and you can you can clearly see. So yeah, we have those checked off. So let's go ahead and create the chunks for them. All you do is just do the, the two by two crafting, and you create a chunk. Uh, two by two, two by two, perfect. All right. So with those, we can actually start to have some. Fun. Fun here. Okay, Cinnabar, we got it. Niter, we got it. All right, now we got to smelt them up. Um, yeah, Blast Furnace is going to be our best friend when it comes to that. So let's go ahead and get those smelted. Um, what? Okay. Weird. Okay. I guess we have to melt them down. Um, hmm. Basic ingot can be made in a smeltery or basic melter. Pour molten fluids into an ingot cast to get ingots. Well, we don't have an ingot cast just yet. It's not included in this guy. Okay, so it looks like we do have an option with sand. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, I just about died. <laughs> uh, yeah, falling into the lava and this is pretty much dying. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to use red sand here. We're going to try this out. Um, how do we even start the ingot? Uh, we could use brick. That's probably a good one. Um, all right, so we got a brick. Uh, clicking it. Doesn't do anything. What about that? Nope. Wait a sec. Oh! You just freaking click them in. There we go. <laughs> freaking heck. That was easier than I thought. Okay. Let's clear our inventory out. Okay, so we have copper here now, and I believe it's just one to one. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, we got an ingot. We've got an ingot. 
All right, so we get two per one of those. Uh, so we're going to grab one of these guys, one of these guys. We're going to turn each of these into it. The good thing is it's pretty cheap for us now because we have automated sand. Uh, so it really doesn't matter all too much. Okay, so I think we've hit a little bit of a snag here. Um, we need to, in order for us to smelt nickel, uh, we need it to be a bit hotter, which means we need to use that tank that we made instead of uh, this guy down here. Uh, so we're going to swap this out, like so, and then we're going to need to create a little bit more of the buckets that break so easily. These guys, the porcelain buckets or whatever they're called. Yeah, then we need to smelt these guys up. All right, so that should suffice for now. We have one more lava bucket. Let's put that under here. Yep, and now we have enough. Perfect. Okay, so we need to get some more cobble in there. Because we have so much cobble, it doesn't really matter if we don't use the smashed granite or whatnot. We just let it go. Okay. Ooh, we got to save the cast as well. There we go. All right, so that one has been completed. Perfect. Now it wants us to make Constantine. Okay, how do we make how do we make Constantine here? Okay, so we need to make Constantine nickel, uh, nickel and copper. All right, so we're gonna do nickel, and then it was. Z -z 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 -z. Nickel and copper, right, okay. Should have a few ingots of that somewhere. There you are, copper. All right, so it should be one to one. That should smelt really quick like it is. And then these should mix together. Not enough free space for the fluid. Um, hmm. Okay, so it says the melter does not alloy. You must use the smeltery for that. Frick. Okay, so we pour four ingots of copper onto a heater. We have that. Let's do it. All right, so you're in there. I actually have four ingots of uh, copper. Just got to add three more. Okay, and then pour those in. Ooh, looking spicy. There we go. We got the smeltery controller. Brain of the Smeltery. Where was that at? Tinker's 3. Perfect. We are getting kind of all over the place here, aren't we? Okay, so if you look just a one by one, nothing too out of this world. We can knock that out. Uh, those are just seared bricks. So... We're running out of room. It's kind of annoying. Uh, we're going to do this here just for now. Get some seared bricks. All right, and then here we'll go around like so, and then craft this guy. Okay, boom, boom. Boom, maybe. Does the bottom need to be it too? Smeltery. No fuel. Well, that's a problem. That is solved. Okay, nickel. Okay, so nickel is smelting up. Now we do need some more copper. Well, 
I wonder if the seared bricks do it. They do. That's neat. I should have thought of that. Okay, so we have that guy, and then we put them in here. Tinker's Anvil. Bronze. Look at all that bronze. Bronze made from three copper, one tin. Okay, so that's a lot. All right, we have the Constantine, but don't we need a drain? Ah, yes, we do. So two copper, four seared stone, okay? All right, we are at a copper. Give me a second. All right, let's go ahead and grab up some of these seared uh, bricks here. And we are going to, I don't know what I'm doing, two. I only want one drain. There we go. We got ourselves a drain, seared drain. Now, if we break this block, uh, it shouldn't lose the materials in there once we place it back. Yep, still there. Perfect. So then we can put a drain on this now and get those guys out of there. So let's go ahead and do that. Bam. All right. Drain on the side. Uh, we don't have that guy filled up. And now we have our Constantine. Perfect. So cool. Okay, seared drain. What are you? Oh, a seared shoot allows a... A hopper item into the smeltery. Oh, you can't do that without? That's kind of lame, not gonna lie. All right, there's the Constantine. All right, bronze. Bronze is three copper to one tin. Uh, I guess we have to drain all of that before we do this. Because we don't want it mixing anymore. All right, so with all that cleared out, now we can go ahead and put in our three copper. Man, if we made that a little bit taller, it would be really nice, or just bigger in general. But, oh well, we'll make do with this one. All right, got to put these in here kind of manually. All right, and then the teen, tin, I almost said teen, the tin ingot goes in. Gosh, I'm having a hard time with the words for some reason. It goes in, and these all mix, and we get bronze. So cool. And there we go. We got our bronzing it. Bam. There we go. Overworld matter. Okay, so molten organic overworld matter is made from organic water, tin, and clay. Um, so, yeah, here we have organic water, the tin, and clay. So, we're going to need a lot of tin. Uh, so, we'll have to be smelting that up. And then once we get this uh, molten overworld, wow, that gives us a lot. Uh, we use this when we sift it we have the chance to get iron and then we will be off to the races but guys that is gonna wrap up the episode for today we got the amazing tinker's construct stuff built we had a smeltery we even got a melter oh man so cool we're gonna have to start expanding this base out because it's getting a little compact in here uh but anyways guys hope you all enjoyed if you did enjoy please make sure to hit that like button and i'll see you guys in the next one take care peace out Bye bye